She looks good, she feels good, and she is good. It's Brunette from Armenia. Hi. <laughs> Good to see you. Good to see you too. I've got to say, you've really grown in confidence the three times we've spoken. You know, really? Yeah, in Amsterdam, yeah, feels good you were a little that. nervous, I think. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm, I'm like, uh, now I'm like a bit, a bit nervous, like, yeah. like this. A healthy nervous. It's just, you know, I'm not a talkative person. I don't oh. really, uh, really <laughs> like talking, but to you, it's amazing. Oh, it's <laughs> very kind. But yesterday on the turquoise carpet you were bubbly you were fun you seem to be having a great time yeah it's because of my outfit yeah. i was like uh, really i was feeling really powerful that's why i think i see yeah. <laughs> so fashion for you can be a source of yeah, joy yeah yeah, yeah 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 of course okay <laughs> well one thing i noticed is you love wearing lots of jewelry tell us about that oh um i was wearing like uh, jewelry since i was a little girl my mother uh Pierced your ears. Pierced, yeah, pierced me when I was like two months, I think. Oh, wow. <laughs> and yeah, she also loves to um, make jewelry and create jewelry, and that's why, you know, <laughs> I'm like wearing it and love it. And are you from Yerevan or outside the city? From Yerevan. Okay. Yeah. And what to you is the most magical thing about Yerevan? Most magical thing, uh, I love the streets of Yerevan. Uh, it's full of joy and full of people singing around and playing an instruments and basking on the streets of Yerevan. I was the musicians back then where, yeah, I was singing really? yeah, and basking on the streets of Yerevan wow. with my friends and there was a lot of fun and that's why I love Yerevan because people are really uh, welcoming and they are mm. really kind. Yeah. Did you ever sing at Cascade? Yes. Yes, I was. Well, girl, the next time you're there, I'm going to be throwing money in that hat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And when you were busking on the streets, I guess, what types of songs were you singing? Was it pop music, traditional music? Traditional music, pop music, also the music that we wrote with, uh, with our friends. Yeah, uh -huh. I'm writing music, oh, writing wow. songs, and uh, sometimes we were also singing the songs that we have wrote. Okay. And I guess those experiences of, you know, performing for strangers on the street, do you think that helps you today? Yes, of course. Of course. With that communicating with your audience, with the fans, mm -hmm. and also uh, you gain confidence uh, while performing on the streets and then yeah. on the concerts, and it really helps, yeah. And I've got to tell you, you were looking confident in that rehearsal. You were. Yeah. You look so good. Do you feel good up there? Yes, of course. I was really enjoying it. The wind and the lights and yeah. everything was like magical. It was just so, how do I say this? The colors, it was like you were inside a rainbow or like an, an, an ice cream machine. You know? <laughs> For you, when you're sitting there, can you see the audience or do you see the colors that are coming uh, to your body? I think that I... I can see the audience. Okay. You know, on the rehearsals there weren't any audience, but uh, I can feel it that I'm gonna see the audience, and that's yeah. that's really good for me because I really love uh, while performing. I really love to look at them and see that they are there, and it it helps. Yeah. And we talked about this on the turquoise carpet, but what does all the light symbolize? What is that about? Okay, so for me, uh, at the beginning, uh, it's like pinkish and uh, that beautiful, uh, cute colors. Uh, for me, it symbolizes the uh, purest and the magical love. And uh, I really love it. Mm. I think it looks great. I think it, um, I think people can really understand what I'm feeling while singing the song. Yeah, no, definitely. It's really impactful. And what's also impactful is your rapping, you know? It's very unique at Eurovision. My question is this, when you were deciding how much rap to include, were you nervous or did you see it as something exciting? To be honest, when I was writing Future Lover, um, at first when I was writing music for Eurovision, I was like really nervous because like I couldn't write anything. Yeah. Because I'm like, oh my god, I need to write a music for Eurovision, how to write it, a dance song, or I don't know, a ballad, what to write, what to write. And then I was like, let it go, and yeah. 
write whatever you feel. Yeah. And I wrote Future Lover, and I really do love rapping, and that's why I was like, I'm gonna show people that I can do it. And at first, I was a bit nervous because um, I didn't see anyone uh, rapping before, yeah. and uh, but I thought that I can serve it. I, I can <laughs> serve it, and people would like it. That's why I. Yeah. I did it. Yeah. You look good, you are good, and you do good with that rap. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now, Karia from Finland, he raps. Would oh, you? Yeah, yeah. Really, really. Maybe you should cover his song. Oh, yeah. I could try it. <laughs> but I think it, his language like difficult. Oh, it's a little hard. Yeah, it's a little hard. <laughs> Maybe just the cha-cha-cha part. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but speaking of this year's artist, are there any other songs that you would like to cover from Eurovision? I really love uh, the Netherlands song. Okay. Really love it. It's so beautiful. Oh, yeah. And when I was in Amsterdam uh, for pre-parties, that was that song was my soundtrack. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was like uh, walking on streets and listening to that song. It's perfect. Oh, that's really beautiful to yeah. hear. It sounds like you're a very how do I say this? Emotional person. You absorb energy and people's feelings. Yes, I am. I am. Sometimes it's really hard. Sometimes mm. it's good. You, I don't know. But at first, like, uh, I was like really enjoying that I'm emotional because I can um, feel the energy all the time. And but then uh, at times uh, you can feel that sometimes it, it it's really uh, you know it's. It's easy to hurt me, you know? <laughs> yeah, I see. Yeah. I and see. And that's why it's kind of... Yeah, but you know, you're a strong woman. I feel it. You know, because we talked about this previously. In the lyrics, there's the word panic attack. Yeah. And you've yeah, learned yeah. to overcome this. Yeah. I guess my question is this. Here at Eurovision, all the cameras, all the lights, how do you keep yourself from panicking? How does Brunette stay calm? To be honest, when I'm on a stage, I don't feel no pressure, ah. no, no pressure, no, no anxiety, nothing. I'm feeling really calm, mm. just a bit of um, butterflies. Yeah, 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 and that's good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, much. Uh, sometimes I feel uh, like my panic gonna come yeah up. come up when I'm doing an interview, but not. Not to oh. you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love this. She ain't blonde, she's brunette. This is my favorite thing to say. We've been walking around the streets and we see blonde people are like, she ain't brunette, she's blonde. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> now, you've been compared to Ariana Grande. People think she's your twin. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I see that on the comment sections, but I don't see it. Really? Yeah. Ah, maybe it's because you're also like petite, but powerful. You maybe, know, like. Maybe, yeah, yeah, something. yeah. yeah. And um, I gotta say, or I want to ask you, do you have a support network here? Are your family here? Or is it mostly just your delegation from the TV studio? It's my delegation. Also, my delegation became my friend. So, yeah, uh, yeah that's really good. Also, my mother here, my Beautiful. producer here. Yeah. And my mother is like everything that I need here. Really? <laughs> yeah. Is she a powerful yeah. woman? She's a powerful woman. She also does my hair, so... Oh. Better yeah. stay on her good side. Don't make her angry. <laughs> no, 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 no. I love you, Mama. Oh. And has anyone besides Mama given you good advice for Eurovision? Maybe Iveta Mukuchan or another singer? Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, they are all supporting. They are all uh, standing on my back. Yeah. And they are all with me. And I'm really proud of that because my people are strong and they are with me. Barev, hi Esther. Barev. <laughs> you know, I went there once in 2018. It was beautiful. Thank you. The food was delicious. Come here, we can call, come go and yeah. walk around. Oh my God, I would love that. And when I was there, Iveta Mukuchan, her face was on the money machine. Oh yeah. Next time I come, I want brunette on the money machine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> can Let's we make see. this happen? <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> and just a final request from you. Do you think you could serenade our viewers with a little bit of your song? Of course I can. Thank you. Okay, let me sing. Um, okay. I decide to be good, do good, look good. I decide to be good, do good, look good. I decide to be good, do good, look good. 
Ari satu bego jogolukut. Oh my goodness, Thank honey. You. Nora Carluzia, that voice is beautiful. A voice from the heavens. I just want to thank you for coming to see us here thank at you Lush. For me. Oh, you're so welcome. We have a little goodie bag for you from Lush. These are some beautiful soaps thank and you so bath much. bombs. Thank you. Thank and you. I'm not saying you're dirty, girl. I'm just saying this will make you extra nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank you, <laughs> thank you I so much. For, you for too. me? Yeah. Oh. Do you mind oh, if I... let's do this. I do love a gift. <laughs> okay. This is like a postcard. Oh, wow. And also an envelope. Oh my goodness, to, your future to my love. future lover. Yeah, yeah. He's my current Sending. lover. <laughs> yeah. write, a, write the message to your current lover. This is Thank so beautiful. You. Thank you so much. We will be writing letters all night and we yeah. will think of you. She's not blonde, she's, she's brunette. brunette. <laughs>